Over there, the clothes are coming down. They drive right closest to me coming in this direction. Anyways, we're gonna go a different direction from here. That is, I'm right beside the auto motor store and uh, goes into a car. Not any car, a car that almost looks like it came from Jurassic Park. Making this a unique one. So I'm gonna make this a little short one, but I wanted to show, to show you um, this unique car is just right over there that really does look like it came from Jurassic Park. What does it read? It reads Jurassic Park. Right there. It really does look like it came from Jurassic Park, but it, it actually isn't. It isn't that something. And that this is um, here, a, a, par a parked out of, um, from the um, car part shop. And that's it, it, this thing here. And again, it really does look, look, look like it came from Jurassic Park. But no, it's actually, again, look back, it says Jurassic Park. The car may look like it, but the car does not even say it. It all it says is is Jurassic Park. Wow. Completely interesting too. Here's the round view. Isn't that something? A very interesting one. And again, so here it is a little short a short uh, yeah, short fit. So I'm gonna bring this to a wrap. And when, we, when the snow melts down even more, we'll get to some more episodes of Beyond the, the Rail Tracks as well, too. And I'll tell you a little bit more on the um, series right now. As it is, I'm currently um, facing up on projects in regards to it already. Very quickly here, we'll get right into it. Anyways, it must be off. But we're still late. Race, peace, much love, and blessings. Now let's end off. From right back over there. And now I'll zoom in.